Okay, so what I wanted to tell you about is on Facebook, you know how it is when we want to invite friends to join a page or a group. Well, a lot of times we have to sit there and click, click, click one at a time. Well, I found a tool that allows you to invite all or most or many of your friends at one time. And so I wanted to share that with you today. Um, the first thing I want to do is call up a Facebook page. So I'm going to call up a page, one of the pages that I managed, that I managed called Passion to Opportunity. That's one of my pages. So <clears throat> here over to the right, you see where it says invite friends. Let's click on that. And if you notice, because I have installed this tool, here it is. It says toggle all. Now, but before we do that, I want to show you how to get this tool onto your computer. So what we want to do is, now this, I use the Chrome browser. So this is working in the Chrome browser, but I believe that Internet Explorer as well as Firefox has, they have Chrome add-ons. So if you install the Chrome add-on to Firefox or Internet Explorer, then you can use this tool. Or I suspect if you did a search in the Firefox and Internet Explorer add-ons, there may be a similar tool. But this tool that I'm talking about today is working in my Google, in my Chrome browser, Google Chrome. Okay. So you want to the first thing you want to do is go over to the Chrome Web Store. So if you go over to the Chrome Web Store, just type in Chrome Web Store in your search and search bar, and it'll come up. Once you're at the Chrome Web Store, you want to type in Facebook Inviter. I N V I T E R. Facebook Inviter. I N V I T E R. So once you've typed that in and you hit enter, it'll bring up the Facebook Inviter. And as it says right here, it adds a toggle all button to Facebook's invitation pop-up for fan pages, events, and old groups. So once you've gotten that called up here, you want to go ahead and add it to click Add to Chrome. Now I've already added it, so that's why mine is grayed out, but it would look something like this. It would look like this if you haven't added it. So go ahead and add that, and it'll it'll automatically put it over there so when you open a Facebook so if you click on it though it'll tell you exactly all of the things that it does so let's go back over here to Facebook so once you've add, added it to your your browser when you call open the invite friends feature in Facebook you should see a link that says toggle all but before we go there what I want to also show you is with the recent changes that Facebook has made, when the friends box pops up now, what it does, it defaults to your recent interactions. So you can, you know, if you want to just send it to that group of people, that's fine. And if you notice mine are all grayed out because this particular page, I've already sent an invite to them just, just a few hours ago, actually. Now, if you want to see all of your friends, you just click on this drop down box and the very next selection is search all. And what you see in these lists are these lists of, these are the segmentation of my friends. Some of them are by default. The ones that are by location are by default. Quick fill, sorry, Facebook segments them by location. And they quick, that's something that Facebook does by default. And then if you look, below it these are the lists that I have created for my friends um, and you know because I communicate with them differently and I have security settings for each one of those lists but that's a topic for another video so you want to go ahead and if you have segmented it you can just select one of those lists or if you want to just click search all friends that's fine so you click on search all friends and again, because I've already communicated to these folks, you're not seeing um, all of them unchecked. But there are some that either were added yesterday or maybe these folks have their settings. Or it could be that when I did it earlier, Facebook put a limit on how many I can send all at once. And I suspect that that's probably why some of them are still unchecked. So here I am. I am going then to... 
use the toggle all key again and it should show me that the remaining or if not all of them then most of them and it looks like what Facebook is doing is limiting how many I can send it to all at one which is fine because this still beats doing it one at a time so if you notice I just selected all of those people all at once and again it looks like um, Facebook is limiting how many I can send it to which is you know that's their prerogative I guess so but you know I'm going to now submit it to the people that Facebook did allow me to toggle and I'll close out of that so I'm gonna click on it again to see just what is remaining of my friends so it looks like um, Facebook may have gone and sent it out but what I've also noticed I want to tell you you have to be patient with this because I'm willing to bet that when I come back in here a couple of hours from now I'm gonna see that a few more of those people have been invited so even though the tool isn't perfect and even though it may not behave you know the way we wanted to behave because of some of the Facebook um, restrictions I still think it's a very good tool it's a neat tool it's quick and it sure beats trying to invite people one friend at a time so hopefully you think it's useful if not then that's fine but I wanted to share it with you and um, I hope you will find find it useful if so could I just ask you to please leave a comment below and if there's anything else about the Facebook and the new the changes in Facebook that you would like some help with or that you feel you know that some instruction would help just make, leave a note and let me know and I will try and address it for you so thank you for stopping by and I'll see you next time take care bye bye